guys, here we are at Knott's Berry Farm. We've gotten into the park and we're gonna see if we can find a key or a clue or something from Mr. E. That was the one! So this is gonna be fun, guys. Ooh! Whoa! That's cool. Now this is gonna be the scariest ride you've ever been on, buddy. Just you and me, Corp is the only one brave enough to even try it. Here we go. On the route? Let me take you on the road. One family on a throne. Cause we got, we got it. We got treasures and more than shit we got. Guys, let's open the chest. Yeah. Let's see what's inside. Okay, let me take another look at that key really fast, Corbin. It doesn't fit. So I remember Mr. E saying that there were three keys. Yeah, so, there is a 12 on that and a 12 We on haven't really that. inspected this treasure chest. It's just not me. <gasps> what? what? Oh my gosh, okay, I gotta see that again in slow motion. Hang on, let me see that key. So you tried to put the key on like this and it didn't work. So instead you put the key on like that. Yeah, I noticed that first. Whoa. I noticed that first. Now what, does it open? Oh, there's another! Ooh, is it working? No? Hmm. Here, let me try. Man, this is crazy. Do it. Doesn't seem to be working. Maybe that's what we need the next key for. No, it, it has Hi, Ellie. Like, it's not dead. Look, it has a pattern for like this. Uh-huh. So I think maybe it's just it's hard to turn it, maybe I can. What did I do? Let's go ahead and give it a try really fast here. Is it turning? I think it's Don't break it now. It worked! What? <gasps> wow, the whole thing's coming apart! <laughs> that is so cool. <gasps> Look at that hole, guys. I, I know what to do. Ooh. Hmm. Is it fit? No. Is that? Is that the so do you think that there's one more key? Or do you think that the one key has three purposes? Yeah, that's the way to close okay. it. You're closing it again. Keep. Or do now we need to go find another key? Then this part is the last because this is the part that says the one. So do you think that this one key has three keys on it? Yeah. Miss Streak said we needed three keys. Can I see it? Mm -hmm. So I'm not seeing anything in this that would fit into this little hole here. So maybe we need to look around a little bit more and see if we can find something else. We haven't really explored this box because there's a couple of things on this box we haven't really looked at. This WD, for example. Walt Disney. You think it stands for Walt Disney? Yeah. What does this mean, though? Marceline, Missouri. Does anybody want to look up Marceline, Missouri and tell me what, yeah. what they find? Uh, hmm, okay. We'll do a little bit more research on that today and see what we can find. But for now, let's see if maybe we can find another key. We haven't shown you guys the, the place that we're staying at. Do you guys want to see it really fast? Take a look around. It's all like Star Wars themed, which is kind of fun. You've already seen C-3PO and everything, but there's a air hockey table, got a dining room. Here's the adult bedrooms. Here's a big backyard, which is really cool. Do you guys want to show everybody your bedroom? Yeah. Let's go show, show us your bedroom. Ellie and Charlie normally sleep somewhere else. They always take our blankets. This is the kids' and throw it bedroom. Off. <laughs> they always take our blankets and throw it off the bed. Uh huh. Yeah. Cool. 
And then here's my bedroom and Rebecca's bedroom. We got this really cool artwork on the wall. This is a place. It's a little bit messy, this so. This is one place where we get changed. Yeah. And then here's Grandma and Grandpa's bedroom. They have all sorts of cool art on the wall and even Darth Vader watching over them at night. <laughs> Look at this. Okay. This is like awesome. It's right there. What? Oh, that's kind of cool. Millennium Falcon's coming out of the wall. And guess what? The R2D2 is right there coming out of the wall. Yeah. There's one more thing I wanted to show you guys. They have all these really cool like Star Wars books. Have you guys looked at the Star Wars books at all? Maybe there might be a clue inside one of these books. Oh, that would be cool. Really I have cool. read one. Did you? I read the droid one. Did you guys know that last night someone tried to break into <gasps> our house? I found a clue. <gasps> what? Ellie found a clue, guys. It's right here. No Yay. way. <laughs> cool. Here. Be gentle with it. Maybe I should try to open it because that might be a little bit too hard. Wow. It was just inside the book? Mm-hmm. I wonder if there's more clues here. Could I see? Let's see. Can you help opening it? Oh, no, she got it. Good job, Ellie. Ooh. It's not the same clue as before, is it? It no. It's not. I don't know. It kind of looks like it's folded the same a little bit. It yeah. is folded the same. Can I read it? Okay. I'll let Carbon read it. The next he you see may seem a universe away, but it's closer than you think. Go to a land of fancy known for film studios and special effects. Let the magic continue and look all in the hidden places for the key. A um, spell may be needed to reveal its location. I think it's Harry Potter world or Why? land. Why? Yeah, because that's in California. It's really close from here. Okay. Like 30 minutes. That's in here. But, but why do you think Harry Potter land? Because it says so you need a spell to be needed. And, and magic. magic. And magic. And universe. See if Harry Potter wants Universe. Oh. Universal Studios. Universal Studios. Universal. Whoa, I think you're right. Well, should we get ready to go? Yeah. We have a wand that sticks out. Okay, let's go. Yeah. Good job, guys. We're here. And guess yeah. what? I decided to bring this because we were going to Southern California and I was like, maybe there's a chance we'll go there. <laughs> So I'm all dressed in my Harry Potter stuff. Cool. Yeah. Cool. Bumblebee. What are we doing here? Thank you so much. We're at well, Olive Andrew. Andrew. Welcome right down this way, please. Come right towards me, please. That's perfect right there. Thank you so much. Corbin, what are we doing here? Getting wands. Getting wands? Are we looking for something else? A key. A key. That's oh, right. A key. Wizards and Buggles. Welcome to Olive Andrew. Your wand fitting experience will begin very shortly. So we're just going to load you, uh, your parties first. After they're situated, we'll load the rest of the room. Woo! Oh my god! <laughs> oh yeah, three wands. That's very impressive. <laughs> <tight. laughs> that is a great one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right there. Kind of right here. 
you're facing me as well. Brilliant. Fantastic. It's a fine one since 380 BC. I'm the wand keeper. You're here to witness one fitting. You're very welcome here. But I ask for concentration. This is momentous for a witch or wizard. It's a very complicated process as well. Now I see you have a wand, dear. Yeah? Which wand do you have? Oh, you have a collection, Bruce. Yes. yes. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, are you a wand maker? Yeah. <gasps> That's quite wonderful, my dear. Excellent workmanship. What's your name? Rebecca. Rebecca. Do you yet have an Ollivander's wand? This one. Uh, Miss Lovegood's one, yeah. yes, but not one that's Rebecca's one. No. no, I think it's time. A wand maker needs an Ollivander's one. So, can someone hold Rebecca's collection for me? Uh, come right this way, Rebecca. Okay. You're going to be right here in front of the desk. Oh, well, there you have it. Here we are. Now, stand here, hold your wand, hand over the desk. Now, you dear, you also have strong magic on me. What's your name? Chantel, do you have a wand yet? No, it's clearly time. I might need to join with them. Now, uh, hold your wand hand over the desk. Now, as you may or may not know, every wand here is one of this contains within it a core of a magical substance. Uh, we use unicorn hair, phoenix tail feathers, and the heart strings of dragons. Now, no two wands are the same. Just as no two phoenixes, dragons, or unicorns are the same. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> and you'll never get such good results in another one. Uh, you can put your hands down, my friends. So we are here to find yours. Yes, not Luna Lovegoods. Now, we'll start with Chantel. Not tie Rebecca. I promise we'll get to you, dear. Now, this is a wand of ivy. It is uh, 13 inches long. And uh, rather flexible. Quite fun. There you are. Now, let's do something different. I'd like you to bring a wand box down from that wall, all right? You can choose any box you like. Name your wand, say Accio Wand Box. Accio Wand Box. Okay. <laughs> all right, very exciting. Um, <laughs> that is a no for you, all right? That's not your one. But again, lovely work, clearly powerful, and easily fixed, right? Uh, for power of... <laughs> Not as clear, of course, is why. So, we press on. find in here, Corbin? One of the most powerful ones in the world. Which one are you getting, buddy? Uh, Professor Dumbledore. Dumbledore's wand? Yep. Does that wand have a name? Called the Elder Wand. This is, this is, this is my wand, which is Harry Potter. James is getting Harry Potter's wand. And Ellie, what wand are you getting? Hermione's. You're getting Hermione's wand? I want to see it. Ooh. Very nice. Cool, Corbin. Drew, stay focused on that key. You did it! You did Good, it. Job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Okay guys, so we've been all over Universal Studios. We are right now in Harry Potter land. You can see the beautiful Hogwarts castle behind us. But we still haven't found this key yet from Mr. E. So we need to look around the park. I'm gonna ask these guys if they have any ideas. Do you remember what the clue earlier today said from Mr. E? Find a key. Said find a key, right. But did it give us any clues or no, hints as to where the clue, where no, the key might yet. be? No, not yet. No clues? I seem to remember it saying something about magic or spells. Oh, here's something that I think. Oh, 
I think that because there are spells you can cast here, we did get some wands, and today's our only day here, so we might as well just go to cast wands and be on the lookout as we go. That's good, because didn't those wands one? come with maps? Yeah. Sure. Let's look at some of these maps and see if it might give us a clue to where we is should this go. This one, Ellie's? Mine. Okay, this is that Ellie's. Ellie's? Yeah, this one's Ellie's. Okay. This does have a map in it. I want to look at that map. Maps have keys. Charlie, no! Is there any hint on the map to... Oh, here's... Show us where we need to go. Ellie got here's wand. Ellie's Hermione. James, let me see the wand you got. Harry Potter. You got Harry Potter's wand earlier. This one That's is very Hermione cool. Hermione Granger's, but actually Ellie Beach's wand. <laughs> and here's so there's, the map. The map tells us where the cool spots are to use the magic, right? <gasps> Something's written on there! What? Look! Oh, did we get a used map? Wait, no, what does that we say? didn't get a used map. Okay. What does that say, you guys? It says key. Key. Key 10. Key 10. Ten. Ten. Where's 10? Okay, we gotta go find whatever. It's 10 is over somewhere okay, this let's way. Let's go find wherever it is. There are spots where you have to cast spells and they're on the ground. There's like things. Maybe there might be a key laying on one of those. Oh! Let's go. How do you think that it got that word written on the map? Did you see the map? No. There was words written on the map that said key. Maybe. Do you think Mr. E wrote that? Do you think Mr. E wrote on our map? Maybe, maybe, maybe he told them to give. Maybe he told them to give that on the map, and he uh, told them to give us that specific wand. You're right. We have wands. We do have the wands. And actually, I remember when we were getting the keys, Becca, you weren't there for this. When we were getting the keys, she kept, or not the, the keys, the wands. The yeah. worker kept switching out the boxes. Really? Like the exact box that we brought. She switched it for a different box. Really? She really did. And so maybe she was, maybe she instructed from Mr. From Mr. E to give us a specific oh. box that had a specific message in it. Wow. So we gotta look around. I know there's a lot of different places you can cast spells here. We gotta Wait, find the right the one that corresponds the with the map. Can I see the map? Debra Bangs. Okay, it's over there. It's over there. Let's go. Oh, is there a plaque here? This is a map of all of the different places that you can cast spells. It's on number 10. So look for things on the ground. Is it that one? Um, I don't know if that's the right one. There's a little plaque on the ground. Oh, there's a plaque. You want to try this one? Yeah, it's this one. You have to say, what's the spell? Locomotor box. So what's so number? So we're the wrong one. Oh. So we are right. Uh, 
We're in the wrong place. Let's keep looking. I think it might be back down this alley, actually. Okay. We're definitely in the wrong area. Oh, there's cauldrons here. And what's the spell? What's the words for the spell? Silencio. Do you know what that means? It means that the bubbles will stop making noise. I think Ellie did it. Good job, Ellie. Your magical spell worked. Are we in the right place? It worked! <laughs> Good job! Now what does the map say? Is number 10 Silencio? Are we in the right place? Silencio! Yes! We are in the right place. So let's look around for a key. Whoa! We found it! Whoa! We found the key! That's exact! we needed to open up the rest of the lock! So we followed the map and there was a key here! Whoa! <laughs> yeah, there was a thing in it! Maybe that's, you are supposed to open Let me see. That. I want to see that. Yeah, that's different than the other one that we found. That was just a trick lock! I was right! Whoa! That, that wasn't there before! No, it wasn't. That was not there before! I maybe it magically appears with these wands! Yeah, maybe when you cast a spell, it triggered the key to appear. From Mr. E? Wow! That's wow, cool! Well, should we get home and then we can yeah. try it out? Yeah, let's go! Alright, cool! Thank you, Tia, for the pictures! I love that picture. Me, Easter egg. Thank you, Kate and Ollie. This is definitely going up, up on our wall. <laughs>